So one of the things that I love to do is coach women on boundaries, how to set them, how to strategize them, how to have a boundary inventory, what are the boundaries I need. And so often women come to me and say, oh my gosh, it's all about work. Work is draining me, my job is exhausting. And we go through all the boundaries they have at work, which actually many times they have good boundaries at work. Do you know where they have terrible boundaries? Home. <laughs> okay. The more that you are not in your home, the more guilt you have. And that leads you to actually over function, over promise, over deliver, and actually do things in your house that drain you or serve people in your house that drain you, but have come to expect it because you don't ask for help or set boundaries. So it's really important as women, and I talk about this in my book, Brave Boundaries, get it, it's now on Audible, by the way, um, is you have to take a boundary inventory on the boundaries you have at home because so often we are over-functioning at work and because of that, we don't feel like we're home enough so we then overpromise, over function at home, which also leads us to burnout. It's a two piece puzzle. You can't have one without the other. Both are a vital part of your life. So you have to understand what boundaries you really need, both at work and at home. And that's what I talk about in the book. Go to and purchase it now if you haven't on Amazon. You'll love it and it'll take you through strategies and kind of an inventory and you can go, oh, I'm really good at that boundary. Not so good at that boundary. Uh, if you love this, please subscribe to my channel. Go to becomebraveenough.com and sign up for my Friday newsletter. I give a little encouragement every Friday. I don't spam you. And thank you for listening.